There's still a view that there's misalignment between IT and its wider context, whether that you're supplying services to a larger business organization or you're directly supplying services to an outside market. There's a, there's a challenge where there's an alignment issue that's still being addressed. We seem to be going a, at least not in the same direction or at the same speed. Our structure for the last hundred years or so has been focused on task specialization, and this specialization has delivered great you know, specific skills, but it's also structurally created a silo-based mentality where I have a lot of people who believe their job is just this, and there's no view or desire to open up the context of the systems thinking mindset. So the reality is a lot of things which are happening today is the connectivity of the PPM space and the ITM space. You have to have insight on both planned and unplanned work to know what your true capacity is for delivering value. You can't govern what you cannot see. If there's no service owner looking at the continual improvement and legacy, no one's making the claim in a business context what the improvement would actually mean, no visibility into the cost of technical debt, right? What's going to happen? You're going to always justify the net new and postpone the retirement conversation. So you can't look at improvement just left or right. You have to look at the improvement as a value system and connect these two primary value systems together to get the transparency you need to allow you to inspect what the problem is and allow you to make adaption decisions along the whole system. These are key areas of lack of visibility. Would you agree? It's all guess in the air. You can't govern what you can't see. This is a reality. Organizations typically learn to improve in three stages. The first stage is this. Someone has an idea, we should get better at something. Whether that's internally or externally driven, you decide and wake up one day, we should be good at change management, we should be good at security, we should do architecture, we should do planning. Something arises, somebody comes up with a conversation, that's awesome. Forrest, you've got security and risk, you run with that, bud. All right, and so Forrester runs over in the corner and then uh, and so I'll go say, hey, I'll take change, and she goes over here, and they each create processes in isolation, put them on their own tools and their own databases, and we've got process silos. We have to get a systems mindset to understand how we go from silo behavior, I'm a bumper master, I only do bumpers on the assembly line, to I'm a systems community player. There is a national, national identity, not just a tribal identity even if that national system is made up of different people with different diversity. That's also true. Diversity is normal. That's life. But you can't govern what you cannot see. So I'm excited, you can tell. I'm passionate about what's happening. And I'm really excited to see what this is going to do for our community to bring us together into more of a national versus tribal identity. Thank you.